Hi! Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to display the date and time in the top right header of Dashboard 2.0. Let's get started. As a reference for this tutorial, you can visit the FlowFuse website and check out the article titled Customize Theming in your FlowFuse Dashboard. Scroll down and look for the section example, adding logged in user profile. We'll use the example code from that section, but instead of displaying the user profile, we'll modify it to show the date and time. To display the date and time on the right side of the header, you just need to replace the do attribute with hashtag at bar actions. Let's edit the flow code in the node red editor. For the accept client data option, I'll keep the UI template checkbox enabled. Now, add a new flow and insert a UI template node into the canvas. In the type option, select widget UI scoped. For the UI option, choose the dashboard you're working on, which in this case is my dashboard. Then, give it a name, for example, date time dashboard 2.0. Next, delete the current template code and replace it with a modified template that displays the date and time on the right side of the header. This is an adjusted version of the example code we referenced earlier. Make sure to add the do attribute with hashtag app bar actions to position it correctly. Next, don't forget to deploy the changes. Here's the result. Let's open Dashboard 2.0. You can see the date and time displayed on the right side of the header, updating every second. This display appears on every page of the dashboard, ensuring that the date and time are always visible no matter which section of the dashboard you're viewing. However, it's important to note that the display date and time are based on the client's computer, not the server. This means that the time shown may vary for each user, depending on their local system time. Next, I will modify the setup to display the server time from node red, ensuring a consistent time across all users. This way, the display time will be the same for all users accessing the dashboard, regardless of their local system time. First, add an HTTP and node. In the URL field, enter slash server time. This creates an API endpoint in node red, which can be accessed by the Vue.js front end to retrieve the server time. Next, add a function node. Inside it, enter the following JavaScript code to create a date and time object based on the server's time and send it as a response to the Vue.js front end when the slash server time URL is accessed. This ensures that the front end receives the current server time instead of the client's local time. Next, connect the function node to an HTTP response node. This ensures that the server time data prepared in the function node is sent back to the client, Vue.js, whenever the slash server time API is accessed. Next, in the UI template node, update the template code to display the server time. In the fetch server time function, make sure the server address matches your node red server and the URL is set to slash server time, as per the API endpoint we created. This ensures that the server time is fetched and displayed correctly on the dashboard. After deploying, here's the result. Now, the dashboard displays the date and time in the right side header, based on the server time. This ensures that all users accessing the dashboard see the same time, regardless of their local system settings. I've placed the example flow in the video description. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you in the next video.